here with head coach Gina Thomas following today's 19 to 8 victory over Kent State. Coach, just take us through the game today. Uh, what are some of the takeaways coming off this victory? A um, little disappointed with our first half. Um, I think that we came out, um, kind of the snowy weather had us, a little uh, adversity hit, and we didn't um, come out strong. That's something that we've worked on all season, and we did a pretty good uh, job with that preseason. So a little disappointed, but I'm glad that we were able to kind of turn it around um, after halftime and come out and um, some big people step up and score some big goals and um, got a, a freshman in the cage for the second half and made some saves, so that was great. And talking about big people stepping up, let's talk about the uh, scoring performance today of Monica Borzello. Seven goals, one off of her single game high. Uh, just talk about what she's meant out there leading the offense today. I mean, Monica's a baller. Um, she's a kid that can put the ball in the back of the net um, at will. And for her, it's just her staying green and keeping her teammates in a good place and um, continuing to stay focused and mentally uh, hitting adversity with her team um, and moving through it. So. And we also saying on the offensive side, uh, Gianna Napolitano, Big day again today, a career high for her four goals. Uh, just what did you see out of her? Uh, absolutely, and we, we know Gianna is a really a critical uh, part to our uh, the offense. Um, she's a kid who we know can put the ball in the back of the net. It's just getting her to uh, catch the ball first and continue to stay confident. Um, I pulled her aside before I put her in and said, you need to put goals in the back of the net. You need to catch, catch the ball inside and score. Um, so when she did that, we were happy for her. Um, that's what she does in practice every day, so it's glad to see her do it um, come game day. Uh, defensively, I mean, you said earlier you weren't happy with the performance today, but just talk a little bit about uh, Kate Bricado coming in and seeing the second half of action and maybe some of the other players that kind of stood out to you in your mind uh, defensively. Sure, and um, that's the, the hard part with uh, Kent State. This was being their first game. We, we weren't really prepared defensively, so we focused a lot of, of it of being our system. Um, so we just didn't do that in the first half and then kind of got settled a little bit into the second half. Uh, Kate Bricado is a kid um, as a freshman that's really, really confident, so I'm glad she went in there and uh, made some big saves for us defensively. and. Um, had our defense, uh, had our back, and we were prepared. And that's the support we need um, with all three of our goalies on our team. All three can come in and stop the ball. So we just all need them all to be prepared. And finally, no rest for the weary. Coming up Friday, uh, big rivalry returning. Marquette coming to town for a noon game on Friday. Just uh, a quick look ahead to how you they think your team's going to look, what they're going to need to do, that type of thing against yeah, Marquette. Yeah, absolutely. Marquette's a tough team, and uh, we we haven't been lucky against them. We've lost, I think, six straight. So um, they're 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 beefing up their schedule, and they got uh, they played Notre Dame and Louisville. So we'll we'll get right to that video and look at the game and kind of figure out ways to beat them because they're tough. Um, it's going to be a really physical game. So I'm just hoping that our team is ready and step out there and be ready to go. And um, I think we have the the tools to beat them, and I think they have some some newcomers in, and they have the system where it's going to be a hard fought game so um, for us it's just being tough and uh, staying in a green place and big kids stepping up and making big plays thanks for your time coach and good luck the rest of the way thank you